Hi boys and girls and welcome to our craft on the first day of Bible school. And today, if you looked in your Bible school kit, you would have seen a plastic Ziploc bag that had pieces in it of these that look like these and that uh, we're going to make a magnet that you can either hang on the fridge. Now today your lesson was choosing the right path and Sherry talked to you about that sometimes there's things along the paths that we want to take that may not be good but we want to follow the right path, the path that Jesus wants us to take. So this magnet that we're making today is going to be a good reminder that we hang on our fridge and we can put um, we can when we look at it then we can remember oh Jesus wants me to choose and do the right thing. So the first thing is take your big magnet piece that you've got there like that and lay it in front of you. And then we're going to take the big styrofoam one that says trek with faith. And trek is another word for walk. So then we're going to, if you look on the back, there's some white stuff. You're going to peel that off. There you go. And if you look at the shape on your magnet, you can kind of see on that black strip right where this lays. So it, it just sticks right on there. It's really easy. Now the next little thing, you see our path running up there. Well, each path um, here, we're kind of going up into these mountains, needs some trees. So you'll see a little green card like this that has, I believe, five trees on it. And you can really decide to set those trees anywhere you want along this magnet. Now I'm just going to stick mine on in some different places so that it looks like we've got a forest that we're going to walk through our path on. Just kind of place them anywhere you'd like them to. Whatever looks good to your eyes is fine because this is your magnet that you're making and we want it to look in a way that would be pleasing to you. Now remember, as we're doing these crafts and things, we want to make sure that we check with our parents to see where they want us to have them or hang them because they can go on a refrigerator or maybe in your room somewhere. Lots of different places that the magnets can go. All right, so we have our trees on there. And like I said, there's no wrong way to put your trees on. You can put them anywhere you like. Then the next part is a little trickier. We're going to take, and I have here a little stamp pad, and you can maybe check with your mom or your dad or grandma or whoever you're doing this with and see if they have a stamp pad. And what we're going to do is press our finger in there, and we're going to make some little footprints going up our path. Now, if you don't have a stamp pad, there's a lot of different things that you can use. Maybe your mom or grandma or dad or someone has some craft paint and you can just put your finger lightly in there and do that. Or the other thing that you can do is you can take a magic marker, any kind of magic marker, and do it on a piece of paper. Make a, a real dark splotch with the magic marker and put your finger on that splotch and then you'll get some ink on your finger and you can make little prints with that. Or you can even draw little footprints on your magnet. Whatever you have, whatever will work for you and whatever's okay with your parents to use. All right, now we're gonna put our magnet face down and our last two pieces are really important because this is what we're gonna use to hang it. There's a little white strip that looks like this and you're gonna wanna peel one side off and stick it in the middle of your magnet. And then you're gonna peel, there's, a, there's two sides of this, so peel this other one off, and then you're gonna take your magnet and you're gonna lay it right on top of that sticky strip and your magnet is ready to go to remind you to walk with Jesus. Trek with faith, believe in the way that he's taking you. So make sure you get that magnet on there and that should hang on the refrigerator or anything magnetic, but check with your parents so you get it in the right spot. We'll see you tomorrow. Have a really good rest of your day. Bye-bye.